should have gotten this purple book and your set of materials from the school. It says health and wellness, grade three. And it looks like I don't have the whole cover, but there's a, a baseball bat and a baseball glove. Please pause the video and go find that book. Great, you should have your health and wellness book. I'm gonna open my ebook so we can look at it together. And we're going to go through the pages and we're going to go to today's chapter. We're going to start talking today about mental and emotional health. So you see I'm clicking the pages in my book. You should be flipping through the pages and you're gonna to come to this teal kind of colored page, Unit A, Mental, Emotional, Family, and Social Health. So we're gonna use this because you have this book. We're gonna use this for our health activities. You should please turn to page A4 and A5. If you look in the lower in the lower corner of your book, you'll find the page number. Pause the video and make sure that you're on the page that looks like this. Great. We're going to talk about how health is well-being because it's Wellness Wednesday. We're going to find out what is well-being. Well, it is having a healthy body, it is having a healthy mind, it is getting along with others. So we're going to learn about the three parts of health. How choosing healthful behaviors protects your health, how choosing risk behaviors can harm your health, and we're going to learn 10 life skills that can help you take responsibility for your health. We're going to learn these words throughout the next several weeks. Health, life skill, health goal, and health behavior contract. Today we're going to learn what the word health means. The three parts of health. Oh, there's three parts to health. Health is more than being free from illness. Health has three parts. Health is the condition of your body, mind, and relationships. Okay, so health has three parts, body, mind, and relationships, which I just saw when I read this question. It's having a healthy body, a healthy mind. Oh, relationships, it's getting along with others. All three parts of health affect your well-being. The way you act or behave affects the three parts of health. You can learn how to make wise health choices. You can even set goals for better health. Behaving in healthful ways helps your health. This shows that you are responsible for your health. Look at this. Your well-being depends on the three parts of health working together. What are the three parts of health? Family and social health is how well you get along with others. It involves your relationships with family members, friends, and people in the community. Mental and emotional health is how well your mind works. It is how well you express your emotions. It is also how you feel about yourself. Physical health is how well your body works. A healthy body helps you do the things you want to do. So what I would like you to do is write a definition of the word health. And I want you to draw a picture of the three parts of health, your family and social health, your mental and emotional health, and your physical part health, and how the three work together so that we can be healthy.